really, uh, my association with IST is, a, is an association with Paul Seabright, who I met at conferences some time ago, and then we spent some time together at the Santa Fe Institute. I'm very uh, pleased to be included in such a list. I know uh, both the other speakers uh, on the, uh, they're, they're on the poster. Uh, one of the reasons that I, I'm keen to speak to this audience, and, uh, and I've interacted with Paul and other economists, and kind of synthesis going on between economics, anthropology, evolutionary biology, uh, which brings some of the mathematical and, and theoretical rigor of economics to, to bigger questions. And there's, a, and there's a close kind of connection between evolutionary theory and biology and evolutionary theory and economics. And these, these, over the last 10 or 20 years, have kind of come together. And I think it's an exciting time. Uh, that uh, we're making progress on questions that have been around for a long time through a combination of, of empirical work and, and theoretical work. So I'm going to uh, talk about the role of culture in human evolution. So uh, modern people left Africa about 60,000 years ago for the first time and spread across the globe in what from standard evolutionary terms is an instant. Uh, in 20,000 years people were lived all across Eurasia and in another few tens of thousands of years every place in the world basically except Antarctica. So we're a huge evolutionary success and we became a success very quickly. Um, on the other hand we do a whole bunch of very odd things. So we climb mountains and uh, become celibate priests and all kinds of things that don't very make, very make very much sense from a standard Darwinian evolutionary point of view. And so what I'm going to try to convince the audience tonight is that um, both those facts arise from the fact that we're cultural organisms, that we rely heavily on learning from other people in a way that no other animal does. And, uh, and that... Um, capacity, reliance on culture, both makes us an evolutionary success and makes us susceptible to um, peculiar behaviors like rock climbing, religion, and so on. So that'll be the theme. <laughs>